Hi, today I want to show you how I made trunnions for my homemade wooden bandsaw using my CNC router. So I drew a file to cut the trunnion, have the file loaded, the CNC is zeroed, and we're ready to cut it. I didn't cut quite all the way through with the CNC, so there's a little bit of material left here. And now I'll just trim this flush using a router. So here's how all of this goes together. This is the trunnion support beam. This, these bolts here bolt down to the frame of the bandsaw. There's five dowels go into here and into the end of this beam. And these are the actual trunnions. The other side has this recessed area that we cut on the CNC and that's for a bolt. It goes through here and the bolt head is on this side. There's a block of wood that goes here and then when we loosen that bolt we can pivot this and we can tighten it at any point. My table is going to tilt from minus 1 to 46 degrees. One of the advantages of using two pieces of plywood and gluing them together later is I can drill these holes into this now just by clamping this down now for this final hole I had to remove the clamp so I stuck a Forstner bit in this hole it has exactly a 3 8 shank so that'll keep that referenced and then I can line up these just by feeling and now I can drill that. One trunnion cradle is oversized all the way around. And that's so that when I glue these two together, I don't have to be real careful. And I can just trim that flush with the router later. Same thing goes for these pieces. One is oversized all the way around, so I can trim it flush later. And since the one piece is oversized, all we need to be careful when we're gluing this up is to be sure there's a little bit of a reveal all the way around. Now I'll lay this quarter inch drill bit in here to keep that lined up.
Now I'll pull that drill bit out. Here I am drilling the hole to the proper depth for the dowel. So the bandsaw is now finished and unfortunately I did not film gluing the trunnions onto the beam or screwing the trunnions to the table. That's pretty straightforward. They turned out real precise, very little seam here and yeah they're they work real nice. Well, that's it. If you enjoyed this project, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Come back.